Hey pool owners, it's Rob with InyoPools.com. Today we're going to show you some common methods on how to find an air leak in your system. Uh, some symptoms of an air leak in your system could include uh, air in your pump strainer. Uh, you could have low PSI on your, uh, the pressure gauge on your filter. You could have uh, air bubbles or real weak flow from your return jets. Some common areas where you might get an air leak would be the pump lids uh, O-ring on the lid. Uh, it could be from these valves in front on the suction side of your pump, which is going to be anything before the pump. So any of these diverter valves, they have O-rings in there that can go bad and they can draw air. Uh, any of these joints in the plumbing are areas you'd want to check. Um, if you have a suction cleaner, um, sometimes the hoses will get uh, holes in them and it'll draw air into those hoses. Now, without further ado, let's get us some of the methods that we can use to find these air leaks. Okay, the first method you can try is using some incense around the suspected leak area. If there's a good leak, you'll see the incense being sucked in. We can see a little bit going in there. The only downside of this is if it's a real windy day, it's going to throw a wrench into uh, the smoke here. But you can see some of the smoke going in. Alright, another method you can try is shaving cream, putting it around the suspected area. If there's a good air leak there, you should see some dimples in the shaving cream where the air is being drawn in. All right, another method would be to, to get some dish soap, mix it up with some water, get some bubbles going, and put the bubbles like right where you think the leak might be, and you can easily see the bubbles being drawn in here. So you'd know exactly where the leak would be. So in that case, it's on the valve, you'd replace the O-ring. Okay, so of those three methods, we saw the most reaction from the suds, uh, from the dish soap and the water. Uh, probably second would have been um, the smoke from the incense, followed by the shaving cream. We didn't see a whole lot of reaction from the shaving cream. Um, one other thing you can try is, um, if you have a garden hose, um, while the pump's running, you could, you could run the water over a suspected area and let it run for about a minute or so. And if the bubbles disappear from your pump strainer, you know that's where your leak is. That's worked for me in the past as well. Um, but if you have any questions or another method you've tried and it's worked, uh, leave a comment down below or visit us over inyopools.com. Thank you.